we're going to take a look at a simple build for the Jagger. It mounts two gauze rifles like the old gauze cat, and gauze rifles have been recently changed where they require a moment to charge up. I'm assuming power is being redistributed from your reactor to a capacitor bank that ultimately fires these magnetic um, slugs down the barrel. I can only postulate, I haven't read anything <laughs> regarding it. Uh, but they take a moment to charge up, and then you have a brief window while the capacitors are charged to fire the gun, so it requires a little bit more skill than they used to. Uh, they still have an excellent range of fairly high damage and very low heat. We do actually have double heat sinks on here, but that really doesn't matter. I have it on for other builds. Now, we have an extended large, um, an extra large engine that makes us a little bit more vulnerable, but we're fairly quick and it allows us the extra tonnage to mount these two 15-ton gauze rifles. The remaining ammunition I just kind of put around the torso. It's not critical because this is um, non-reactive ammunition. It doesn't blow up. The gauze rifles themselves do blow up, however. And I'm not too worried about that. They're in the arm sections and they're as far away as they can get from my main torso. We don't have anything else on here. Um, I have ammo's the armor has been distributed as such. I'm always kind of front heavy. Uh, it's far more likely that I get taken out from the front uh, than my back sections, which I kind of always have light. Uh, and also similar to legs. I still have 30 in here because since we're a little bit more smaller, there are more impacts on our legs, but I rarely have a leg blown out. If I could end up putting these down to a level that I felt acceptable and putting more ammunition on, I could, but I think I had to bring these down to 15 per leg, and that's just unacceptable. That, that'll get blown out. So, with this build, we don't do as much damage uh, as we do with some of the other Jagger builds, but it's very satisfying to being able to blow out a compartment, and we do actually get a fair amount of kills, normally because we can kind of finish the job, or sufficiently damage someone enough where our team can kind of roll over them. Occasionally I'll come across a uh, light capping a point, and rather than attack him right away, I'll sneak up, aim for one of his legs, and blow it out, and at that point in time he's pretty much uh, dead. Uh, anyone, including myself, can slowly aim on him, and he's not going to be able to run. That's their main defense. Um, otherwise, we're going to try this out in the field, see how it does. Um, Terra Therma, this does pretty well because of our massive heat efficiency here, because the gauze rifles don't do much. If I had some more room, I would put on some medium lasers, because we do have to be very careful with the 60 rounds of ammunition we have. That's only about 30 shots, but uh, we'll try it out here. All right, I forgot the name of this map. There was one guy in the ready queue, and there's always one, isn't there? There's always one guy that does not press ready. What are you gonna do? Can't make it go any faster. So we generally want our teammates to go in a little bit before us. We're definitely not a brawler build. Uh, we're more of a sniper. When we are in fact a sniper with high weapon mounts and two gauze rifles. Uh, you can see that the top r left reticle uh, section turns green when we end up charging the weapon, and we only have that amount of time to fire off the weapon before it becomes inert again, and we have to charge again. So there's a little bit of skill that is required, uh, more so than prior. But they do have very excellent range, and I still do really like them. If I had some more room on this mech to put down some uh, medium lasers, I'd be very happy. But right now, I need at least 60 rounds of ammunition. Otherwise, it runs out! So we can see someone over here. Huh. Maybe they went the other way? I really hope this doesn't end in some sort of cap victory. That's always this in point. Oh, never mind, we're in conquest. Yep, I'm all about peripheral vision. Got my head on a swivel. All right, I'm betting they all went over to the left, so I'm gonna start heading towards Theta. We should be able to see some folk. Looks like we are. Take out that ballistic compartment over there. Apparently he doesn't care that we're firing on him, so I'm just going to keep firing on him. New target acquired. Getting a little bit behind us here. Damn it, the thing's still not... New target acquired. Oh, okay, there was a delay there. Apparently he had gotten blown up. Uh, so he must have lost his ballistic compartment. Shoot this guy in the arm because I can't really see anything else that's terribly vulnerable. I don't like where I'm getting. I'm kind of getting in the midst of things. 
Can't see that individual very well. There's some guys over here. We're pretty scattered out for a team at the moment. Hey, buddy. I'm gonna move back towards my group before I get my shit kicked in. It's very difficult to aim these weapons when there's four or five people shooting you. Quit targeting me with your laser! That infrared beam you keep seeing around the edges are uh, somebody tagging with a tag laser. I haven't got fired at with missiles, so whoever's using that, there's nobody else really watching. Every time I go somewhere, my team moves! Need to back up! I don't want to brawl! Let's fight this guy over here. In what is apparently a brawl. Because that's exactly how I roll! Stave stuff and then, uh, uh, come on, come on now. His back is pretty juicy. His front's pretty juicy. Oh damn, we lost him. We lost him. Luckily we don't have to fire if we don't want to. We'll try to turn around here. Damn, that was not the shot I wanted. Oh, come on! I must have hit the side compartment. Damn it. Focus up, buddy! Focus up! We gotta shoot that torso! That's how he's gonna be taken down! Taken downtown. There we go. Oh, hey, buddy. I don't wanna brawl. Unless it has to. Rot row! Rot row, Scooby Doo! What the hell is happening? How are you doing that magic? We need to get his torso! We need to get his torso! There we go! Screw you! Or the Emperor! Alright, we have a um, major wound on our right shoulder. We do have an extended large, er, an extra large engine, so that is a critical vulnerability. If that gets shot out, then we're pretty damaged. Uh, we're gonna blow up, in fact. I'll really try to help this individual over here. Nah, he's fine. Luck we don't waste that shot. All right, round up. Uh, the other team's starting to cap now, but I think we have a, uh, a good uh, advantage over them. Still want other folk to be brawling for me, because otherwise I'm going to get shot in that shoulder. So don't get up there. Don't get up there. I've only got 12 rounds left, which equates to about six shots. In fact, exactly six shots. I'm fighting people. It's hard to think, damn it. All right. Um, shit, we should really... Uh, there's lots of folk here that I don't necessarily want to get up to really closely. But let's, let's try to help with that shadow guy over there. Unless they're escaping, because then I'm not going to be brawling. A good shot to that shoulder, and I'm down. Um, so we're taking Sigma. I would like to take Epsilon. I could back up and try to fight. Oh, shit. Don't look at him. Don't look at him in the eyes. Oh, damn, they got us. Our shoulder blew up. That's alright, we didn't have too many shots left. We killed two people, we got some assists, we did a decent amount of damage. Uh, let's speculate. Who is this here? Shadowhawk, two ACs, large laser. Doesn't look like he's gonna be in there very long. Um, is this man powered down? You know, that's a decent tactic. We might win on a, a victory points if we can end up holding out for a while. I think given uh, his current distractions, the enemy team is slowly capping out the points. Um, it's unlikely we were going to win because of um, destroying the enemy team. So, uh, there we go. Large pulse lasers. I'm not hugely a fan. Uh, they're way more. They're hotter. I do like the shorter burst duration, but 
I don't think they should weigh more. Yep. But as you can see, our build does run low on ammo. Um, luckily, I shouldn't say luckily, we died before we spent everything, but it's kind of sad when you're sitting there. I've had to use the Jagger to cap with at certain points after I've ran out of enemy ammunition. Um, but usually we can do a fair amount of damage prior to that happening. And I said we were going to brawl, and I totally brawled, and shit happens. Just carefully line up your shots, make sure that you're not hitting different compartments, because you can definitely plow through somebody's core compartment or a ballistic compartment or what have you, but if you're just firing randomly, those shots are going to be on different compartments, and you're going to get your ass kicked and waste all your ammunition. So we're just, I wonder, unless they can take out Kappa, and given that he has pretty much full reign of, oh no, oh no. Stay alive, buddy. Stay alive. Who do we got else? All right, that guy's staying alive. I think we're, I think we're good. Unless they take down Kappa, we're gonna get it through uh, points. And I don't foresee them taking out Kappa that quickly. I occasionally see some smaller locusts. And those kind of suck because they're so low in the water in certain maps, like Crimson Strait in this one, that you can't see them. You can just see the tops of their damn mech. Uh, however, I've one-shotted them several times so far with gauze rifles, so I'm not sure how great those mechs are. However, there we go. We won through points. Not as great as it could have been. I think we did all right. Um, I definitely kept getting uh, disoriented, like I always do. So, there you go. All right. So, where are we here? Uh, we did pretty well. We get the highest damage on the, um, our team, but we're really looking for kills. Uh, kills and destruction of compartments. So I think we did all right here. Uh, we did have a disconnect. It uh, wasn't too bad. Player statistics. Decent component destructions. Um, yeah, I think we did all right. So this is the general build. Uh, if you'd like to see more of these, uh, please like the video. Then I can end up making quite a bit more of these. Well, time, time depending. I have a day job, damn it. Alright, thanks for watching.